Hi friends, welcome to the Take Better Photos channel. We're here with another video and this time we're going to be doing another exciting AI noise reduction comparison video. This follows a previous video I did where I compared DxO D Prime with On One No Noise AI. And in that video, D Prime edged out no noise. So the current champion is D Prime. But in the past few months, two big names have updated their noise reduction. And that is DxO in October released Photolab 6 with the improved D Prime XD. And that followed Luminar Neo in August to release an extension called Noiseless, which also uses AI noise reduction. So with these updates, we thought it would be good to pit the current King DxO with new contenders to finally crown an AI noise reduction king. As per our practice, to make the comparisons fair, we're going to let each app process the same set of images. And at the end of the video, we will have a slideshow comparison so you can be the judge on which one you think is best. But before we go to the slideshow comparison, let's first quickly run through how to use each editor, starting with Luminar Noiseless. So Luminar Noiseless costs 389 USD, which is part of an extension pack. I do recommend waiting for a sale to get better value. Do consider that their extension pack consists of not just Noiseless, but also Upscale AI for image resizing, HDR Merge, and other upcoming ones. Okay, so here we are in Luminar Neo. So how do you actually use Noiseless? It's pretty simple. All you need to do is just click on the image and just click on Edit. And if you've installed the extension, the Noiseless extension, it's gonna appear right here on the right panel. So you'll see under Extensions, you have Noiseless, and you see that it's actually working with RAW. So all you have to do is just Open this up, and then you can have three options. Typically, always choose high. And you can see now it's very fast. The previous time I've used Noiseless, it took forever. But with the recent update, Noiseless makes better use of the GPU. It really is blazing fast. It's almost instantaneous. Now, I'm at high here. I'm still seeing a lot of noise here. So I'm just going to increase the luminosity and see how that works. And that's how much it goes. Color denoise. So that's pretty much as far as it will go. You can also compare it with the original by clicking on this I button here. There, you can see there is a significant improvement. But that's how you use Luminar Neo's Noiseless. Now let's take a look at the next one, which is Topaz Labs Denoise. Topaz Labs costs $80. It is a standalone noise reduction product and quite well reviewed. So here we are in Topaz Labs Denoise. In Topaz Labs Denoise, you can actually drag a folder of images in and you can easily navigate from one image to another. So as you can see here, if you zoom in, it will actually preview the images correctly. You can also click on the original here to see the effect. Uh, another unique thing about Topaz Labs Denoise is it has a bunch of models which will give different types of noise reductions. So the standard is the best for most images. That's the standard look. As you can see here, not much effect. But it also has clear and then raw, severe noise, and then low light. I find that uh, my preference is clear because I want the clearest possible noise reduction. That's pretty much how to use Topaz Labs Denoise. You can also save multiple images at once. That's another advantage, or just one image at a time. So if you have a lot of noisy images, you'll get things done a lot faster with Topaz Labs Denoise. Finally, let's run through Deep Prime XD. This is currently available in Photolab 6 and costs 219 US dollars. D Prime XD claims an ISO improvement of 2.5 stops. Pretty impressive when the previous version D Prime was already very good, claiming improvement of two stops. All right, so here we are in DxO Photo Lab 6. So how do you reduce noise with D Prime XD? 
So let's just open up the image here. This is the noisy image. So if you've seen my other videos where I compare D prime with D prime XD, you know how this works. All you need to do is just go into the details panel here. And you can see here that you have a few options, right? D prime and D prime XD. Right now it's already actually set to on. So D prime XD is already in effect. Unfortunately, it does not preview here in this main window. But you can actually see the noise effect by going here into the magnifier tool and just clicking on an area you want to view. And you can see here in the magnifier window that there is noise reduction going on. You can even adjust the luminance here. It is the luminance without it. And there is a bit more luminance. And you can see the noise is actually getting reduced a lot. And it's, we're only halfway, right? You can actually even go much further to get the cleanest possible noise. Unfortunately, it is not showing here. So you need to export out the image to actually see the results. Then that's what we're going to do in the slideshow presentation at the very end. All right, so that's DxO Photolab 6 D Prime XD. All right, so that's an overview of each of the softwares. So now let's view the slideshow. And at the end, I'll give my results on who I think is the winner. So I hope you enjoyed that slideshow comparison. We tried our best to showcase photos that clearly show the noise reducer's effect. But which one is the winner? So let's run through my thoughts on the performance of each. First, Luminar Noiseless, which came in at third, had the weakest performance in terms of the details. More of the details were blurred compared to the competition and color noise still remain even after setting noise reduction to the maximum. But I still have to compliment Luminar for the improvement of noiseless over its legacy noise reduction. Topaz Labs came in second. It did a better job of maintaining much more detail and its images were certainly cleaner across the board compared to noiseless. The best performer, in my view though, is still DxO D Prime XD, which removed the most noise, kept the most details, and rendered the best color, making it seem that the shot was taken with a low ISO, much more than the competition. So for raw, to my eyes, the clear winner is D Prime XD. Congratulations, DxO, for maintaining your ranking. That being said, if you work with other file types like JPEG, TIFF, or DNG, I will actually recommend Topaz Labs Denoise for its excellent performance across all file types, RAW or JPEG. I found Topaz Labs could handle any file type competently, and its RAW performance was very close to DxO. Note that DxO D Prime works only on RAW, and while Noiseless supports JPEG, its performance across the board is significantly worse than Topaz Labs. 
So there you have it, a qualified decision, but I think the correct one. Tell me what noise reduction software you use. And I hope you found this video helpful. Let me know if you agree or disagree. I'd love to hear from you. And if you like this content, please support the channel by subscribing, liking, and sharing to help keep the videos coming. And till the next video, I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.